You and I actually connect back to Conestoga College. <laughs> and they used to tell us when I was in school about guess who one of our graduates is, Mark Hebsher. And, and me and the guys, we just, we were so excited about that to follow in your footsteps. So I actually did a phys ed degree in Western in London, Ontario. And then I graduated out of that degree and wanted to get into, into broadcasting. And so I went to Conestoga. But while I was there, I was there for just one year. And that's when I started to volunteer at TSN. So I used to drive into Toronto from, from Guelph and Kitchener every weekend and volunteer. And I worked in the tape room. So I did the tech stuff. And then I saw Mark Jones through the glass in the newsroom, who is now you know down south at ESPN. And I thought that's where I want to be. So in April of 1989, I became a flugan, Mark. That's what we were called. I know. Flugans, yeah. <laughs> we made fifty dollars a shift. It didn't matter how long the shift was, and then the government <laughs> came and took tax off. <laughs> fifty bucks a shift at TSN in nineteen eighty nine. You bet, you wow. bet. But we By were way, so happy to be there, right? Having that opportunity, and we were writing for all the commentators and some of the early shows that I was part of. Pat Marsden, it's your call. Pat Marsden. Pat Marsden. <laughs> Sports page. Sports page was something that John Wells did. Uh, Bob McKenzie in his early days there. Bill Waters. Uh, wow. <laughs> yeah. So that's some of my early, early days in the sports broadcasting business. And, and I must say, it really did set a foundation for me later on. By the way, they lied to you about Conestoga. I never graduated. <laughs> I, I never did. I barely failed. I barely passed my first year. I failed my second year. So I never graduated from uh, Conestoga College. So they lied to you. They lied to you there.